Hello? Is everything working? I hope hopefully everything's working again. Hold on. Let me check the chat if everything's working or not. Guys, do you see me? Yes, you see me? Okay. I think you see me. Hold on, let, let's set Lego. Okay, good. <clears throat> hello, Milo. Alright, so you guys can see me. Great. Um, uh, hello. Oh, okay. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the live stream. Today, we are going to take a look at Roblox Innovations Awards. <clears throat> no, Roblox Innovation Awards, my bad. As you may know, I'm actually one of the nominees, which is great. And I don't know whether if I'm going to win or lose or, or something like that. But hey, if we don't make it, I appreciate it so much, and thank you, everyone. It means a lot to me. Okay, now, before we start doing some stuff, it's right now 8.33 in my time zone, which is plenty of time, so I want to take a look at this so I can show my opinion about uh, Roblox Innovations Award Innovation Awards. Okay, so perhaps we can just keep scrolling down. Hold on a second. Last time I saw something like this was around August, I think? Yeah, I feel like it was around this area. So right here, as I feel like a few of you seen the others, others as well. Alright, so let's take a look at this best new experience right here. So there's Bed Wars, there's Deep Woken, there's Pet Simulator X, there's also Sonic Speed Simulator. Now. For people who watch my videos, I've definitely played Sp Sonic Speed Simulator a lot of times, every Saturday, until over time, I just stopped playing it. Now, let's see here. Bed Wars, I have definitely played this before. It was a fun game. Pet Simulator X, I've also played that before, but yeah, I just stopped playing it because uh, loss of interest. Sonic Speed Simulator, it was great at the start. Deep Woken, I'm not sure about... Deep Woken, though? I've not seen that game before, honestly. But, anyway. Um, if I had to choose, probably Bed Wars. I like that game. I am very Sonic, very sorry, Sonic fans. Don't worry, I'll get to playing Sonic Frontiers um, soon. Now, what about this one? Best Creative Direction. Creatures of Sonera? Deep Woken, wow, Deep Woken again, got nominated twice, wow. Lumia Legacy, The Wild West, I have, I'm if I'm gonna be honest, I have not played these games whatsoever. I am so sorry, but yeah, um, I feel like I've definitely seen Wild West before, so, um, if I had to choose one, I'd probably have to choose The Wild West. I'm not sure, though, but I'll just choose that one for now. Best use of tech? Oh, okay, this one's complicated. I've definitely seen videos of these. They're really good. There's Front Lines, Rolling Thunder, Tunneler, VR Hands. Now, I played VR Hands a few times. I loved that game. Just just patting players, just flinging them, play, playing on the pirate, playing the pirate ship thing where um, my fans get to compete with each other. Well, casual, actually. There's pewing cannons. Rolling Thunder. Oh, I love the gun physics so much, though. Mm, okay. Well, this is my opinion. So, if I had to choose one, I'd have to pick um, VR hands. I like VR hands, guys. I'm sorry. But, anyway, we've gone that. And now for this one. I like this one, obviously. If you see right there. Now, we're going to just move on to this one. So, Video Star Video of the Year... If I had to choose one, uh, my obvious choice would have to be Stronger by the, the Stronger video, music video for, by Oblivious HD. He's also uh, a great animator as well, which is also really cool. That's all I have to say. Now, what about the rest? Oh, yeah. Okay, Video Star Video of the Year. Man, they just had to add Lanky Box there, didn't they? So, obviously, Flamingo, because he deserves that. <laughs> okay, and now... The rest, immersive environment. Ooh, okay. Interval. There's Springs Rock. Druid Sanctuary. 3008. Is this like the. Oh, the IKEA one? This is the IKEA one. So. I played this multiple times before. I like 3008, so I'll take this one, I guess. I'll take this one again. Alright, and now for the next one. 
Uh, best use of Avatar fashion? Gacha Online, Mermaid Life, Royal High, World Zero. You know, I haven't played any of these games. I haven't played Royal High since 2000. <laughs> oh, what? 18, 2017? I'm not sure. Uh, Gacha Online? I'm not sure which one to choose because I haven't played any of these games in a while. I heard, I heard um, World Zero was good. I've seen a few games of that as well, so I'll probably choose World Zero. Okay then, well, we have a um, few left, so perhaps you can go check this out. Best audio design, Funky Friday, The Mimic, Brobeats, Ultimate Driving. All right, so I played these games. I haven't seen Ultimate Driving again. Um, it's, I'm pretty sure it's a car game. Yeah, okay. Well, I know Funky Friday. I played it many times. But um, there's these people that, like, there's someone named Memory. She showed me this game. I absolutely loved it. The visuals are amazing. And if I had to choose, honestly, I'd have to go for the Mimic. I'm sorry, Funky Friday. You're Just to tell you, you're also great as well. Seriously. And Robates, too. I love the complicated charting for some reason. People don't like it. Just like <laughs> RB Battles 2020. Well, I wish I've, I wish I've been there. Uh, okay. Well, I probably would have been mad too because 2020, I didn't know Funky Fr or F Friday Night Funkin' in general or rhythm games before 2021, obviously. So, Mimic. I'll choose Mimic. Uh, best content update. Ooh, this one's complicated for me. Hmm. Okay, so Jailbreak Anniversary Update, Illumian Legacy, Beach Update, Piggy, Breakout Update New Chapter, Town Events, Tower Defense Simulator Live Update Events. Okay. <clears throat> I've known these two better because I played the live update events. I played the summer update. I played the, um, I forgot who that queen was. She was that last stage queen woman thing. Something like that. And Picky Breakout Update New Chapter. I made a live stream on that months ago. And that was quite fun to do, honestly. So if I had to choose one, I'd probably pick Piggy. Oh, I'm such a Piggy fan. Man, you like you gotta be kidding me. Okay, but I really enjoy TDS, uh, TD, like Tower Defense Simulator as well. That's also that's also really good. I, it's so complicated to pick. I don't know. All right, now perhaps we can just go check this one. Developer Studio of the Year, Century Games, Easy Games, Game Fam, Splitting Point Studios. I know GameFam, they're pretty good at this kind of stuff, but most of it is pay to win. Splitting Point Studios, I played Field Trip Z, I've I've played their games before, absolutely great. So GameFam, um, depends on their content, Sonic Speed Simulator, and everything else with Funky Friday. You know, I'm not sure. Like, I, I honestly don't know, but I've known Field Trip Z, uh... A long time ago and I absolutely loved it as well so I'll just pick Splitting Point Studios because I've known them before and I enjoy that. People's Choice, Adopt Me, Bed Wars, Brookhaven, Pet Simulator X. Hmm, Adopt Me, I respect that game. Brookhaven, I also respect that game too. Pet Simulator X, yeah but that's also a good game. Bed Wars, I played Bed Wars, it's pretty well made so I guess I'll choose Bed Wars for this one. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, guys, just tell you uh, my thoughts about RDC. Lots of really good changes. Like you can swear in Roblox. I I see age preferences and my um in the games now. I mean, it's it's good. Now I can't imagine how many people just sing foul language. Well then, uh, you know that's quite something. So. Perhaps we can just get started. Say, what time is it right now? 8.41. Um, what do we have time? Hmm. You know, I was actually planning to do some doors before we start. Hold on, I should probably go um, get check out the Roblox, innovation, Roblox YouTube channel because uh, we're going to be reacting to there, obviously. So, hold on. I need, to, I need to take a look at the Innovation Awards thing. There you go. I'll switch that tab later, but for now, I've been thinking about doing some doors for a little bit before we start. Now, you guys seen my video about doors? Uh, peop you guys really liked it a lot, honestly. So I should, maybe we should try a little bit before we um, react to the thing. So, yeah, perhaps. So let's just get started then. 
Uh, I'm just going to post a link right here. Say, how are people in the chat so far? Uh, hello. How's everyone doing? You guys doing good? Hold on. Um, yep. People are doing good. No, why? Okay. Why? Lego, no doors. I swear to goodness. Doors before start real. Okay, so I should probably... Oh, no. Not again. Okay. Well, oh yeah. You know, before I start, I need to go check some donations. Hold on. No donations yet. Oh, well. All right, well, that's totally fine. Let's just go take this. Let's go put this link. And now people are saying, no, don't do doors. I'm going to do it anyway because I like that game, like, a lot. It's fun. Now, let's see here. Are people going to join instantly? Because I assume so because it's a live stream. Now, what did I say? I knew this was going to happen, so... Oh, hello. Lego, you suck. You know, I should have expected this. Okay, well, um, we should just do- why are people saying no? Alright, well, this is Lego- Alright, well, jeez, I- I'll- Alright, well, perhaps we can just get started then. We have, what, 17 minutes left? We can wait. It's it's not really that bad. Oh my goodness, lots of people here. All right, well let's just get this started then. Oh, that is hard to join. Okay, I think we got a decent amount. You know, it's 12 to 12 people. That's actually a really bad idea. Um, now I think of it. But yeah, you know, it's it's something. All right. Well, now what are people saying in the chat? People are saying no, no, no. Why are people saying no? Why are people saying no? I don't understand. I literally don't understand at all. But, yeah, for the meantime, let's just do this while we wait. You know? Oh, yeah. This game sucks. How do people... Well, okay, why does my fanbase hate this game? What? Alright, well, let's... Darn. Why? Why? <laughs> okay. Well, let's go do this then, shall we? Now... I've seen the comments on my doors video. You guys complain a lot about me doing some having having trial and error, like for example, walking well in like walking well in door 50. Because there's a high chance of like um Bobby getting me. Oh yeah, just to tell you, my fan base calls the figure Demogorgon Bobby. I honestly like that game. Uh, no, I honestly like that name. Now, I'm just waiting for the owner to say something about that name Bobby or Jared because to say like canon I want him to have these names like a canon fanon names or just canon names in general so yeah we just got through that lever and then perhaps we can just move on now say what door do we have next oh oh no I forgot there's a uh, oh that's seriously not good at all so I should probably hide around this area since that's the safest place I know so that should work Okay, thankfully that worked. Okay, now, um, oh yeah, after this, I should probably go react to George Recollects' Teleport Trap to revisit how much I've improved over the, over the years. <clears throat> Maybe I can explain some stuff about my vision and how I created it. Yeah, you know, I've been thinking about making a live stream about reacting to all of my Piggy RP films at once to see how, to, um, to show you the details and stuff, you know? Okay, well... I need to go get a drink of water. I'm thirsty right now. Alright, well, you know, that was a good drink of water. So, perhaps we can just move on. Now, what's, um, what sucks about this is lag, and there's 12 people. I can oof at any time now, which is not good. Now, we need to find something sparkly. Now, did anybody find the key yet? If Lego oofs, I'm gonna laugh. You know, I might oof in the middle of the game, so I can have enough time to react. Oh, for goodness sake, I th Yeah, I hear him. I hate Rush. Three words. I absolutely hate Rush. I hate Rush so much. But yeah, moving on. Um, oh, Void. You're gonna revive? Imagine reviving. Couldn't be me. <laughs> 
Okay, well, well, that was something. Now let's just move on, and then. Yeah, that was that. Yeah, um, you can only revive once. Die. Oh yeah, Ineffable's here. Hello, Ineffable. Now, I wonder if the rest of the VR, like, Branch Realities team is here in the chat. I don't see them. Okay, well, let's see someone in the chat. Rush scared me. Oh wow, Rush scared you? I mean... Did the lights flicker? The lights flickered. I did not see- what? I did not even see him, are you kidding me? Alright then. Alright, we're just- just try to speed run this as much as possible. Now we're on door, door 30, that's- that's progress. Oh, no, that's- oh, I can't see anything. Uh, well, I don't know where the door is. Oh, is that it? Oh, we need a key! Well, that's something, you know? Uh, hold on, I just saw a door over there, so we should probably go in there. Hold on. Is this- is- oh, I should have brought a flashlight with me. Well, oh! You found the key? That's good. Alright, well, let's just go- all right, well, at least you found the key, so, uh, just go get this. Good, you opened it. Why did it take so long? Uh, now, the eyes part. Oh, you're a key. <laughs> yeah, very funny key. Okay, well. Oh, no, we need a key. That's, that's darn. Well, shucker. That's not good. Uh. Oh, wait, that's the key. Sweet. Now let's just go take this, and then move on. Say, you hate this room? You? You know, me too. It's dark, and I don't like it. Um, now, hold on. Oh yeah, we have ten minutes left. I want to try reacting to it. I want to show you guys a few details. But yeah, for now, um, let's just go crouch and all that stuff. And do this too. Alright. And then, hold on. Yep, we gotta keep going there. So I call the I call Seek Tio because he looks like a goop. I'm pretty sure everyone else does too. He's a nice black goop. Looks like Tio and stuff. It's cool, you know. All right. Now, oh good. At least we made it there. Now ten more doors until Bobby. Y'all are just standing, walking straight. What does that mean? Okay. Well, Lego isn't pro stream. I know I'm not a pro streamer. Hey, well, what about donations? Oh, Mr. Piggy, thank you so much for the two dollars. I appreciate it. And Drip Goku and Vegeta King's Saiyans. I've been a fan ever since you did Piggy. I love your vids, and they best keep it up. Thank you for the five dollars. I appreciate it. Okay, wait, is there a big stream delay? Is that mine? Is is that my stream? I'm not sure. Okay. Well, did you guys get the key yet? You did not get the key yet. Well. Uh, perhaps I can just go take a... Oh, that's the key right there. Oh, wait. What? what? Oh, good. Okay. Why did I not get there in the first place? Okay, well... Let's just go ahead and unlock this. And then how many doors do we have left? We have five more doors left until Bobby. Okay. Now, um... Oh, I hear flickering. Oh, that's not good. Hey, you should play re Recording Room. I don't know what that game is, honestly. I seriously don't know. I'm sorry. Okay, let's just, uh, go replace these. There you go. And then... Wow, why is that so laggy? No, put... What are you... No! Wh what are you doing? <laughs> okay. Void. Okay, now... I'm just gonna go steal one, because the funny. You know? Oh, Sharky Lou, thank you so much for the $2. I appreciate it. Now, let's just go ahead. Oh, shoot. Ah! I almost oofed. <laughs> okay. Hey, uh, PD Joe Films, when is Branch Realities Chapter 2 gonna come? Be patient! We're almost done with that! Now, yeah, so, we've done that, and now let's just go ahead and walk and get the books. I hear books, so let's just go get the books. Oh, you got, you already collected that book, nice. Now, there's definitely a book around here. Hello, Bobby, how are you doing? Oh shoot. Now I gotta do this again. Well that's great. Darn it. Okay. Oh that's it? Alright, well I just gotta wait. Oh, you're still there, aren't you? Now please, if you politely go away. 
Please? Please go away. What are you- Oh, come on, what are you doing? Go away. Please actually go away. Alright. Say, what time is it right now? 8.52. Oof. Alright. Now it looks like someone else is getting chased. Now let's just go ahead and get the rest of the books. I should probably crawl too. And then... Alright, time to walk in but get books. Yep, more books. Give me the more books. I need the more books. Alright. Uh, hold on. More books? No books. Alright, well, I should probably walk and get this thing. I don't think we spot any books so far. Oh, darn. Okay. Out of all the levels, which one do you like the most? I like door 100, because that's probably the most simple one I've seen. Okay, now... Yeah, so far we're doing... What are you doing there, Bobby? Okay, what are you actually... Yeah, I'm getting out of there. I'm getting out of there right now. Okay, well, uh, hey, do we have all the books? I don't hear any, like, s like sparkly stuff. Yeah, I don't hear any sparkly stuff, but do we have enough? So, eight, eight, two, zero, wait. No, we don't have the hexagon. Oh, darn it. Well, we have to go get that, get that then, if we want to continue. Okay, well, um... Oh, I'm... Anyway, uh, so... That was something... I failed miserably. The Bobby again. Alright. Well, oh, I just passed the book? Are you kidding me? Well, you know, that was quite something. Uh, you know, before this starts, like, you know, the live stream starts, the Innovation Award stuff, we should probably go react- I'm gonna go react to my own film. So let me go do that for a second. I'm gonna go get this. Yep, there you go. I got it now. Oh yeah, um, guys, thank you for $3,150 for the St. Jude's Children's Hospital fundraiser. I really appreciate all of them. They're- Okay, now, let's see here. Hold on. There's some ads, so I have to at least skip some of them. Forgive me. Don't worry, it'll show up soon. Just let me do this thing for real quick. Okay. Now, there you go. We've gotten that, and then now I can just go ahead and move this here. Do you guys see that? Okay, good. You guys do see that. Okay. Well, I want to show you guys some of the details you missed. In here. Oh, come on, another ad. <laughs> Why do these ads keep showing up? That's not what I want. Thank you. Okay, now do you guys see that? Okay, now for this, we have right here. Oh, yeah, I should probably turn on that audio. So, why is George knocked out again? So he can recollect his teleport trap in his nightmare. I'm so confused. This is taking longer than I expected. Do you know? I, I'm sorry, I just paused here right now. Do you know there that there's a difference between my animation and today? So, 2021, it looks- the, the animation looks quite fast in my perspective. Do you guys see that? So, in, in my pre- in my recent animations, you know, the Bittersweet Reunion, I just- over time, I want to slow down the animation because I thought, maybe it's a little too fast, and I want to slow down some of the keyframes to show their either- if they react fast or re they react slow, you know, all that stuff. But yeah, something like that. Oh yeah, the donation, that's right. Can I take a look at it? Oh yeah, Chomper Claws. Thank you so much for the $2. Not sure if you read my dono, but good luck with the awards. All right, thank you so much. Oh yeah, I should probably enlarge the screen. All right, there you go. And then little Meow Meow, unique gifts are us. And then little Meow Meow again. Thank you so much for the, the $5 and the $4. I appreciate it a lot. That's good. And then I should I, we should probably continue. Oh yeah, we have three minutes left, don't we? What? Hey, we do. Quick, we need one of you guys to come down here and help us get the cell door open. Wait, what? Where the sewer lid go? Okay, that came out of nowhere! Also, what happened to George? Why does he look like that? <sighs> so, does anybody want to know why the lid was like that? So in the chapter five original cutscene, whenever Maytune uh, like Maytune's cutscene, you know. Um 
Zuzi kicked the sewer lid, or Z kicked a Wait, who kicked the sewer lid again? I, how, did, how did I forget? Hold on. Who kicked the sewer lid? Hey, yo! Uh, I... Okay, forget it. Um, either one of them kicked the sewer lid. It just went flying up, and that that breaks the laws of physics, you know? We don't know where it went. It just it was, like, sticky or something. So I decided to... Funny. Sewer lid go okay, that came out of nowhere! Because we don't know where the sewer lid went, so I, um... I solved that answer. <laughs> also, and then... George? Oh yeah, how many it's minutes do we have left? Oh, two minutes left. This three times now. Okay, long story short. <gasps> you can definitely hear the vo my voice. I wasn't it's really even high. Explaining yet. At least I'm here now. Okay, Paris should be showing up any time now. <gasps> there it is, in all its glory. So, <clears throat> I keep pausing so much. Why do I keep pausing so much? There's so many details I want to talk about. So, these animations, they start. I started around January. And then, do you know about the distorted memory cutscenes? The distorted memory cutscenes are around March, because I was just rushing to get that done. The rest of the cutscenes were from January, February, and March. And then half of March was the distorted memory cutscenes. <laughs> So, I was literally on a tire crunch before I had to edit everything else. But, thank goodness I got that done. Oh, I was like, suffering. So confused. Me too. Perhaps I'll go. Okay, the rest of you should Say, stay here so um, no how many minutes do we suspicious. have left? Then what are we You're like a teacher pushing the video every second. Oh, I got it. <laughs> Just say he's doing a magic trick. I... <laughs> I just hope they you know, make that's it actually kind of true now I think sure of it. Say, uh, 8.59? That's what, what time that it is right now? There's no time. We should I know probably react to this right now. Yeah, good point. Let's get this over with. So, with the items, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know where they came from. That's all I have to say. I mean, it just breaks the... Uh... Oh, you are a reaction channel. Reacting to myself? That's really meta. Okay. Well, it's starting now anyway. I just only got 1 minute 31 minutes of footage. Now perhaps we should go check out um, this. Hold on. Yeah, there we go. Now we're waiting for Roblox. It is right now 9 p.m. I can't press anything yet, so perhaps we can just wait. I am very excited about this. Too bad it's not a game. It's not a game. Good luck, Lego. Thank you, Dexter. Thank you, guys. It's nine, Lego. PTHL Walmart? This live chat sucks. How does it suck? Sorry. Tell me a good reason why, how, how this sucks. Oh, last dono. Thank you for the five dollars. I appreciate it, Chomper Claus. Last dono. I want you to win. Blah, blah, blah. Your point is, you're my favorite YouTuber, and I want to don donate this five dollars to you. Good luck. Thank you. All right. Good morning, Lego. Hello, Jam. Okay. So, like I said, <clears throat> we're still waiting for Roblox, and then, oh yeah, I should probably, I should probably remove this. Hold on, I'll be right back. Hold on, I'm gonna do this, and then go, hold on, hold on, oh, hold on, I'll be right back. Oh, oh shoot, okay, hold on, uh, the social blade thing, I don't think that's, I don't think that's necessary. Yeah, there you go, that should do it. Yeah, that's better. Okay. Well, now, oh wow, 22,789 waiting. Now, ain't that cool? Okay, well, oh wait, hold on a second, I should, hold on. Maybe theater mode? No, I can't do anything about that. Okay, well, hold on, I can't make it big yet, so perhaps I can just wait. Oh, darn it. Okay, well, we're almost there anyways. Can I, like, try zooming in? Does that work? Hold on. No, I can't. I can't do anything about it, honestly. But, yeah, still, we're waiting for Roblox. So perhaps we can just keep waiting. Oh yeah, did I not subscribe to Roblox? How did I not do that for all this time? You know what, let me just do that right now. There you go, I just added a subscription! Yippee! Okay. And now we're almost there. I am so nervous, but... This... It's that... It's... It's the moment we've been waiting for. 
Say, what time is it right now? It's right now 9.02. Okay. Well, we're almost there anyways. They are two minutes late, so I thought I was the only one that was late. You know, there are other live streamers that are late sometimes, including me. But it looks like Roblox is also late too. Ain't that funny. Okay. But seriously though, what are we gonna do for, um... For, um... Oh, wait a second. I just realized this. If... If we're still waiting for this... We can just keep reacting to the video. What am I thinking? I could have just done that. <laughs> My bad. Okay. Well, you know, if we're just gonna if we're just gonna keep waiting, we can just keep reacting to this. What am I doing? All right. Now the fight cutscene. Let me do this first. So, I've been watching some Falco Blockland animations last year back in 2020. There was this uh, Falco vs. Circo video. They did a fight cutscene. I was wondering, what if I try doing that in Piggy? And then people went crazy for it and thought it was anime something. No, I had no intention of it of being anime whatsoever. Yeah, pretty much. But I enjoyed animating those cutscenes. They were fun to do. My first ever was um, PGH Films vs. Alphas, believe it or not. Or was it something else? No, it was PGH Films vs. Alphas. And, uh, yeah. I was quite inexperienced with fight cutscenes back then. I had no idea what to do, so I just improvised everything with the fight cutscene, you know? Oh, yeah, donations. Um, let's see here. Oh, wow, we get a lot. Purple Gamer, Mr. Piggy, Jacob, we plays Purple Gamer again, and C uh, C J G. Thank you for all the donations. I appreciate it. And then now we should just move on with the cutscene. So, oh wait, hold on. It, did it? Is it starting yet? Let me go check. I should probably go check anyways. Nope. It is. Hold on. Maybe I refresh. Did it start yet? No. It's still. It's still there. Okay. Well, perhaps we can just try this again and we can continue. What's he doing over there? Oh, uh, he's doing a magic trick. That's what he's doing. What is it called? It, it's it's uh, it's called levitation. Ah, nice. As a performer, I gotta say I'm impressed. Also, wasn't there supposed to be another person with you guys? Uh, no, no what not are you at talking all. About? Okay, you guys have a good day then. So right there, that was plot convenience. Oh wait, hold on. Did it start yet? Let me go check. No, it did not start yet. Darn it. Hold on. Refresh? No, nothing's happened yet. Okay, well that's fine. I'm just going to keep checking that. But yeah, like I said, um, plot convenience, you know? Felix can forget sometimes. Okay, and then, yeah, pretty much. Now... That was a close one. I'm surprised that he forgot there was another person with us. Come on, George. Where are you? <laughs> God, I can't crawl. So about this part. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Keep going. <laughs> right, th right here. Uh, so. Hold on. Let me let me check here. Uh, let, let me let me play this again. <laughs> okay, this is still pretty funny. So, um, I, you know my films, I want to make it as, um, Roblox accurate as possible. You see, I want to have them, like, I, I, whenever he, Percy, planted in our teleport trap, he just teleported on, on the other one because George picked it up. So therefore, he just teleported right on there and then got jump scared. <laughs> just like that. I want to accurately make the piggy jump scare. Thing is, that's all in Moon Animator and stuff. It's so funny to look at, though. But, yeah, um, perhaps we can... Oh, who's Spidella's mom? Uh, she hasn't paid the child support yet, so... Hold on. Uh, Lego, turn off the live chat. This is cursed. So many weird people are here. Welcome to my fan base. That's all I have to say. <laughs> okay, well then. 
Oh, wait, hold on. You guys are saying it's starting? Well, let's check here. Did it start yet? Or are you guys tricking me? No, it did not start yet. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, um... That's... That's darn it. Okay, now, this part. Z hits... Alphas and the go gonads? Thing is, that was unintentional, and I did not mean for that to happen. If I'm gonna be honest. You know what? You know, I feel like Alphys is dead in this RP film universe. Or, don't worry, he'll just grow back. Last time I said that, that was last year. <laughs> okay. And then, you know, Z and Zuzi, they're just... They're not even surprised. They, they, they've already seen me with the Iron Man suit because, you know, they, they've they been um, living with me for the for the past couple of months, you know, in the safe place. So they I've already showed them the Iron Man suit. So at this point, they're not even surprised anymore and just, oh, okay, he's dead. <laughs> okay, now, uh, I'm not I'm not going to fall for that, guys. It's not starting yet. It's not starting yet. I'm not I'm not going to fall for that. Okay. Now, you know what? I'm going to believe you guys just one more time. I'm going to believe you guys just one more time, okay? No. <laughs> there is absolutely nothing. Are you kidding me? Okay. Well, um perhaps we can just keep going with this. There goes my last one. I keep pausing a lot because I want to say so many details. <laughs> so, you know, with this part, was my last one. I want to make the I want to make the things as accurate as possible. Thing is, I was lazy to do the ladder falling down anyway because you just don't see that in the in the camera. So, what's the point in doing that? All right, so let's see in the chat. People are shipping me with Creek. Why are they doing that? Degenerates? Okay. You go on ahead, PG Joe Films. Z and I need to go back to a safe place and get some things. Good luck stopping, Willow. Thank you, you two. Stay safe out there and meet me outside this place when you're back. Ugh. Oh, see, what? This doesn't even go anywhere! Okay, so that part, there was literally a white part covering that, <laughs> the, the, um, the, the, uh, the exit. So, also, to make fun of that, no offense, I wanted to punch it. I just wanted to, I just wanted them to punch it. <laughs> so, therefore, uh, yeah, it, it doesn't even go anywhere, so, therefore, I'm stuck. Then, how did I get out? Don't ask questions. Come on, everyone. Let's go. Wait. Like, are they even... Is is that even here yet? They're, they're not even starting? How are they not even starting? It's been like 10 minutes. How is that not even working? Okay. Well, we're just... We'll, we'll just keep continuing. Where are Z and Zuzi? They'll meet us outside. We need to go now. And he's still not awake, isn't he? Yeah, he's still not away. <sighs> Among Us is dying anyways. What's the point? Useless tiger. Looks like I'm gonna have to deal with them myself. I already shot someone with this. <laughs> Why not do it again? This one's for you, William. Wait, what? <gasps> no! So, um, like I said about the, uh, the, the Among Us is dying anyways. You guys remember Willow gets run over by a car where Refinery did imposter thing, you know? Because Pony left the TSP, now he's coming back, and I'm also there, which is also imposter Among Us thing. And then, since that was March, I said, Among Us is dying anyway, so what's the point? Well, that aged well, didn't it? Oh yeah, donations, I should probably go check that out. Um, I've been watching since your Baldi videos. It's awesome seeing me evolve like this. Best of luck to you. You got this. Thank you so much, Lost in Gaming and more. I appreciate the five dollars. Now, yeah, if anybody remembers, I used to do Baldi content back then, and then like FNAF content, Baldi content, and then what? Well, the Piggy content, Friday Night Funkin' content, and so forth, and then like pretty much Roblox content in general. But uh, yeah, uh, this part, I want to show you this. <gasps> 
This one's for you, William. I said this one's for you, William. I said it in two different voice lines. So what I did was, I said this one's for you, William, very close, and then I recorded a voice line far away saying this one's for you, William. So therefore, that would uh, it would make it would make it accurate or something the voice whenever it's in a far distance. That's what I do all the time. I just record like go far away from the microphone. If someone's in, talking in a far distance, then you gotta make the you gotta make it accurate. Just don't put the volume down. That's not how that works. You gotta record yourself far away. Yeah. Okay. Anyway. For people who use Twitter, for people who use Twitter and were, were in the picky community, uh, so there was this person, uh, they screenshotted part of the chapter 5 cutscene saying, giraffe. This was the exact th thing that it said, giraffe. And then that, that got popular in the, um, you know, the, the, the community that Many Tunes said, you found the secret ending. No, and I saw that too. I liked it. So, you know what? Why not reference that? <gasps> Which I said it in here. Did I just hear the secret ending? Look who finally decided to wake up. Oh, now you're gonna talk to me like you haven't talked for the past 59 minutes? Also, where am I? This is not my usual spawn point. I'm gonna go check the Innovation Awards thing and see if they're... If anything has happened yet, why are they so late? I don't understand, but hey, you gotta give them patience. Okay, so, um, this is not my usual spawn point. Yes, trying to break the fourth wall there. Now people are saying giraffe. Are we gonna just gonna bring that back to life or something? You know, I think so. Okay, now, uh, oh, Alexander Perez, thank you for the $1.90. I appreciate it. Okay. So I was thinking about this. We've been doing the same thing over and over for an hour straight. So maybe, instead of putting you back to the bunk bed, I decide to put you in the cell. That way, you will never get out. Wait, you can't do that! This is my nightmare! I created this! Did you really, though? Good luck getting out of here. Wait, you can't do this to me! My friends need my help! I can't believe this is happening for the second time! Get him out of here. Do what you can for him. But what about George? He'll stay with me. This part is a reused asset of, um, yeah, th I, that, that, this part is a reused asset of Let's Dance Darling, literally. This was still in a, this, this was still a work in progress, so, you know what, while I was working, I was like, yeah, you know what, I'm just gonna show this as a teaser, and people aren't gonna expect, um, an RP film that's gonna- Oh, it started? Wait, it actually started? Oh, it actually did! Oh, we gotta put the full screen on that. Okay, um, do you guys see that? Please tell me you guys actually see that. Okay. I think- uh, Do you guys see that? I hope so. I actually hope so. Okay. I think you guys see that, so that's good. Attendees at Fort Mason are walking the red carpet now. The event stream will begin once everyone is seated. Enjoy the show. I am seated, so hold on. Let me do a few of the stuff. Let me do a few of my stuff here. Hold on. Let me, let me do this real quick. Hold on. You guys, are you guys seeing this? I just want to make sure. Yes, you guys are seeing this, so. I'll probably save my voice, So, but for now, we should probably um, wait until it shows up, you know? see here. Say, how many live things do I have right now? Oh, I have a lot. Eh, nice. Okay, hold on. But yeah, we are... We are, um, we are almost there. Hold on a second, so... 
Hold on, dude. Is the, like, does this thing have a time limit or something? I think so. Yeah, I actually do think so. Hold on. But yeah, it's right here, so... This is very exciting, honestly. I gotta drink water. Wow. Mm. Okay, that's good. And then... Say, that, is that a time limit for my livestream or something? Like, is that an actual time limit? No, I'm not sure. But... Yeah, I should, uh... Oh yeah. Oh yeah, donations! Doge, man, scary doge! The RP films are awesome, bro! Keep up the good work! Thank you! Okay, well... Actually, yeah, we can, we can actually wait for this at the moment, so... We can just keep reacting to this, and let me- guys, let me know when it starts, okay? So I can just do this. I'm tired of running, Willow. Let's settle this. With pleasure. Let's dance, darling. Three, two, one, go! Whoa! What? How did we switch so- No! 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 I'm not doing this! This is too hard! Whoa. So originally there was going to be a distraction dance, so I was like, hey, um, why not reuse that again and do something new? Since Friday Night Funkin' is getting popular, why not add that as a reference for, um, fan service? I wish I could make a Friday Night Funkin' mod for, I, I mean, I can do a Friday Night Funkin' mod, but I just don't have time. I'm, I just don't have time at all, unfortunately. But, yeah. Perhaps we can continue, so I just want to try replacing it with something else. Whoa, 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 what just happened? Where are Mimi and Giraffe? Okay, so I never expected the cutscene to start like this, so this is what I have to deal with now. This is a lazy transition. I never expected the cutscene to start like that. In Chapter 6, because I, I thought it was going to be, like, different. I thought it was going to take place somewhere else, but... No, apparently not. So, yeah, oh wait, hold on. Let me check, did it start yet? It did not start yet, okay. But it's still there, so perhaps we can just keep waiting. Oh yeah, uh, donations. CJG again, thank you for the five dollars. So, I guess it's us now, huh? Tell you what, to make things easier for you, I'll give you a head start. Pony, go. I can handle this. Actually, no, I think I'd rather start this now. Oh, you want to start things the hard way, don't you? Okay. What was that? Oh no. Filler. Yeah, baby mamas. It's PG Joe Films here, and our PG Joe Films live stream. Good lord, what happened to your voice? No, what are you talking about? This is my voice. Um, no, it's not. This looks like a YouTuber who shakes their camera every time someone's talking. You see, this um, this part was absolutely unintentional. I did not mean to roast Timmy like that. I that that was I I seriously did not mean like that. I, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. I'll just keep pressing this anti-filler button, see if everything can go back to normal. What? Oh, great. Well, we're graphics? I must have done something Yeah, wrong. I'm not gonna well, mention least it's these other two. Oh my god, your Wait, eyes! Oh, I can't do the voice anymore. What are you talking about? We all play- Okay, what happened to my voice? Your eyelids are literally spheres. They just clipped your eyes to make it look like blick- No! No! What? I am pressing this button right now. Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of... Animating your comic! Oh my god. Oh, um, hold on. I want to show you guys something real quick. So, wait, 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 did it start, did it start, did it start? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, wait, we'll just begin shortly. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> we, were so, we were so close. I just heard a voice. I heard a voice. I swear, I heard a voice. Are you kidding me? Uh, okay. It'll just begin shortly. It's not that bad. Now... I- I'll just keep waiting. I'll just keep waiting. Okay. Let's just do this. Let's just keep waiting. Right now. Hey guys, and welcome back- If you look closely right here, that is... Um... Hold on. What was this one again? That's, uh, 100,000- Tenuously 100,000 subscriber trophy. It was the only thing I could think of. So I just wanted to add it there. 
back to another episode because it's of cool animating your comments what is happening? make z and zuzi come with face masks and say they don't want the willow virus when questioned wait who are you and why are you wearing masks these are zizzy's si wait hold on why are you guys wearing masks it's because we don't want to get the willow virus willow virus i don't remember a name called willow virus. she's toxic so um I, th so what the, 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 the stuff, you know, guys remember that community thing where save me with your comments. I made that tweet one time. They guess they have nothing to do with saving me. Like use some tools to make a filler, but Hey, I, I did it anyway. I quite enjoyed it. <laughs> did it start yet? Did it actually? No, it did not start yet. Okay. Um, this one, this was the Mari video one time where I was with fans we were role-playing a classroom and it was on the 10 second period so we we had to record this fast for funny stuff i'm pretty sure a few people remember this okay now that now um this part and why are you wearing masks these are zizzy si wait hold on why are you guys wearing masks chin diaper twins <laughs> <laughs> It's not a mask, it's a chin diaper. It's because we I'll don't want to get, get the willow virus. That willow line. Virus? I don't remember her name called Okay. Willow She's toxic! Did you oh, Nostal Games, thank you for two dollars. I started on Twitch as well. Mr. Stitchy inside. I started on Twitch? Wait, they left you at Twitch? This is my Mari video, isn't it? Willow's pillow falls off her head and she starts crying. Wait, what? This comment at least helped. It was something related to... Help, someone help me to start yet no this one like at least help me she just the pillow fell off and she started crying <laughs> okay no no my pillow it fell off my head <laughs> you are one big crybaby aren't you <laughs> biggie character sing chug jug with you i have no idea why i chose umbrella's one Wait, 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 did it start? But I don't regret it. Our program is about to be- Are you kidding me? Are you gonna like- Ah! But why do you keep tricking me like this? Ah, oh, why do you keep doing this to me? Oh my goodness, why? Okay, so chug jug with you. You know, this also had nothing to do with it, but hey, why not? It's- it's funny. I love it. But we're the same voice actor, so how's- We got a number one we can do you, or we out, yeah, Fortnite, we're about to get down. Ten kills with the boy right now, just- What is happening?! Ten kills with the boy right now, just- What is happening?! I love that cutout- cutout so much. Okay, so Factual here says, This is filler, so a big waste of time. Lego, what are you doing? So, um, so therefore, I had to stop it. Another ad? Are you kidding me? No, I do not want these. I'm s forgive me with the ads, guys. Okay, hold on, it's almost there. All right, good. It's, it's back. back. I kind of like being. Oh, oh thank goodness I'm oh finally back to normal. I kind of like being fat. No, that sucked. I'm not going back there again. Now where were we? The animation is like the way I animated it is so fast. It's just so fast. Oh. Did it start yet? It did not start yet. It did not. I'm going to speed that up just in case. I'm just going to speed that up. I'm just going to speed that up. Okay. So the Innovation Awards is about to start. Please. I want to start so badly. Does speeding it up work? Okay. That should go back to normal speed. So we should be good and probably just react to the rest. I'm 
done playing games. So, <clears throat> the second... Uh, is this, like, starting thing gonna be a troll for me at this point? Please don't do that. That. So, the second cutscene is where I got a little bit more experienced with fight cutscenes. So I should've... And then it got better. I, I enjoyed it. It's so fast-paced. Like... It's so everything is so fast paced last year, but hey, that's just still me trying something new. So I like you gotta at least have some slow paced stuff, you know that all that stuff, and then here this part. Oh my goodness, so meta. Hold on, uh, Vixen says Lego. How about you put the Innovation Awards video on your other monitor so you can see if it starts, and put that tab back if it starts. You know, I didn't think about that, actually. I am so blind. How did I... There. Now people don't have... Man, it honestly looked fun. Prom is so exciting! Wow. Welcome, everyone. All right! Woo! Woo! Hmm. <laughs> Hello. So... Yesterday, at around 10.02, I said this is arguably the most amazing gathering in the world of creative people. And I think it's fair Is the to audio say not loud enough? Right now, anywhere in the world, this is the best party in the world. Right now. Can you guys hear that a little bit? I th hope, hopefully. So, we're here to honor creativity, innovation, technical prowess, art, design, all these amazing skills that our community so embodies. Uh, we are so proud to have all of you here. The last two days for all of us has been absolutely amazing. Uh, I'm so happy to join all of you. And without further ado, yes. I want to introduce, where is he? The super voice of Roblox. Where is Mr. J Party? J Party! Whoa! Alrighty, Dave! Yes, we have arrived! We have arrived to greatness. This is your pilot for tonight. You're in great hands, That's J right. Party. Only minor turbulence. Take it away. Man. All right, let's do this thing. Actually, I'm gonna even give you this mic, Dave. Keep Thank that as a souvenir. Hold on, All guys, right. can, can you hear this? Friends! Welcome! Hello, I am so sorry. I have no idea who you are. Is it the moment you've all been waiting for? I know in your heart of hearts, this year's Innovation Awards at RDC 2022, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be an exciting night. We've got special guests. We've got celebrities who may make an appearance. Who knows anything could happen? But I do want to give you some background. Uh, as you guys know, this is our first time hosting this event live and in person. The Innovation Awards have gone through some other names in the past. Yes. For those who have been here a long time, they might remember the very first time we had an award show. I don't even know if it had a name yet. This was before we even had the concept of the Bloxies. And yes, it was someone sitting on a couch reading from a piece of paper. So tonight, I will also be sitting from a couch reading from a piece of paper. <laughs> That's right, only the note cards will be even fancier, as everything will be bigger and grander and very exciting. So, I know many of you have no idea what you're in for, so this is an exciting night to celebrate your creativity, to celebrate all of you out there, all the work you've done, to celebrate each other. It's an honor to be a part of this community. It truly is the greatest community in the world. I hope you all appreciate yourselves and everyone else in it. This oh yeah, uh, Michelle, experience. thank you so much thank for the $2, so I appreciate much. it. So oh, Cookie! Fun awards I love cookies, thank you. People in the community, how much we love all of our creators. We're going to have some other special treats. We're going to have some interviews up here with some of our favorite creators from around the world. And overall, we're going to have a good time, enjoy some drinks and some delicious food while we celebrate. Oh man, show. it's too bad I'm not there. Hey, well, at least I'm here. And that's all that matters. Now, I 
also do want to mention everyone We're all here. so great out there. I've had a little bit of an opportunity to talk to some of you and meet you as we were getting the show set up. And I want to give a shout out to all <coughs> of you for dressing so fly, looking so great tonight. A special thank you to So Jimmy fly, Jimmy huh? Has his finest hmm. board shorts and sandals on. Truly inspiration. No, I'm just kidding. Brezza, you look great. Where are you? You were dressed up. You look great. Don't let anyone say anything different. So anyway, no, uh, thanks to all of you who got in the spirit, and thanks to all of you for attending in general. We hope you have a good time. Um, you know, without further ado, I think we should maybe just jump right into it. Should we get to our first award? Yep. Jump right into it. Why am I clapping in front of a screen? <laughs> all right, I'm going to welcome some special guests to actually read this award from us for our, from our sat stage near the back of the house. This duo Who is this? Amazing work. They are the creators of Mermaid Life. Hundreds, if not thousands, of UGC items and hold a special place in all of our hearts. So please give a huge round of applause for Maizda and Evil Artist. All right. Oh, who are those? UGC creators? Okay, how's it going, you two? How's the weather way over there? I don't even know. I can't hear you. They're that excited. I can't even hear you. Are you guys doing good back there? Yeah, yes. we're, good. we're doing it's good. Great. We're good. You guys take it away. Well, when you have I have no idea how you got what you guys are, but hey. Roblox, you're, you're cool. Going to have some incredible new content trending on the front page every day. Despite only being released within the past year, these titles have already shown immense potential for continued success and innovation. Achieving millions, if not billions, of visits. Looks like they're Here reading something. Are the nominees <laughs> for best new experience. All right, best new experience. Let's see who will win. Okay, Deep Woken. Okay, I I don't know this game, but it looks cool. All right, that's Sonic Speed Simulator. Oh boy, Bed Wars. Okay. Simulator X. Oh, nice. Pet Simulator X, too. Uh, who are going to be the winners? And the award, <laughs> and the award <laughs> for best new experience goes to... Is it Sonic? Deep Woken! Oh! Okay! That is interesting! Okay. You, All right. It means so much for us to win best new experience. The game was in development for a really long time, but the response we received on release was incredible. It's been an incredible journey, and we're really looking forward to continuing to improve on the game and make good on the feedback that we've received from all of you in the months since release. Thank you. Interesting. <laughs> okay. From artists to musicians to developers, there's no shortage of talented creators on Roblox with boundless imaginations. Our next category celebrates the studios that demonstrated exceptional creativity in bringing their vision to life, whether through artistic direction, world building, or audio composition. Here are the nominees for Best Creative Direction. Best Creative Direction. Okay, Best Creative Direction. Creatures of oh, Deep Kelly Woken. Trupa. Thank you for the two dollars, I appreciate it. Yeah, so Deep Woken got Lumian Legacy. Got nominees two times now. And the award for best creative direction goes to Creatures of Sonaria! That's good. I would just like to thank all of our fans for voting for Creatures of Sonaria this year. And my favorite thing about working on Creatures of Sonaria is how every day I would just be constantly reminded of how talented our artist team was and how they could bring super imaginative and creative creature designs to the table. And it would also just keep me super motivated and looking forward to the next day. I saw a video replay. <laughs> alrighty, alrighty. Thank you, Meister and 
evil artist. That just begins our show. So I hope you all enjoyed. For the first awards, we're going to do something a little different now. As I mentioned, we're going to do some interviews. What's going to be the different? Guests out here to talk through some fun elements of Roblox, their life, and beyond. And to start our show off, we thought we'd bring out a very familiar face all of us know and love from inside Roblox to out. He's been a part of the Roblox family since 2012. He's been a major contributor to the rendering, the physics simulation, multi-threading, and more. He's a man of class, intellect, and general charm. You might know him as Zook CG, but we know him as Arseny Kapulkin. Welcome to the stage. Who's that? Arseny, Arseny. My friend, looking great. Welcome, glad to have you. Go ahead and take take a seat, make yourself at home. How you feel? How you feel? Well, nice to see him here. Good, pretty excited. It's a big crowd, and you know, it is a, it's a big crowd. Is this your first uh, late night talk show slash award show? I think so. Yeah. It is. That's good. That's good. We're hoping to have more. I think. Um, I didn't tell you this backstage, but I want to say I love your shirt, and I actually own that shirt, and I saw it back there and almost put it on myself. So I want to say you're looking <laughs> awesome. What a coincidence! So <laughs> what a coincidence! Party. So, Arson, you've done a lot of speaking at this event so far. I know your voice might be getting tired. Um, you've had a lot of talks about some of the bigger technical elements of our engine. Um, so tonight I wanted to get to know Arsene the man a little more. Okay. Roxana Sanchez, read the story loose. I read it. Don't worry. And so these were the top... Oh, shoot, it actually... Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right, I thought something happened. really get to know the man behind the keyboard. Okay. Who is Arsene? So, all right, let's see if we can stump you with some of these questions. Uh, the first one, Arsene. Hey, Lego, do you, do you like Roblox? Food? I do like Roblox. Mm -hmm. I think I'll have to say deep dish pizza. Deep, deep dish, dish pizza. pizza. Hmm. All right. Interesting. That's not mix well with the keyboard, but no, no. Other than this, is much better. Oh, that's disgusting. Man. Morning for all of you out there. All right, the next very important question for you, Arsene. Uh, what is your shoe size. This is important stuff, folks. We're going to get to know them. Um, so I think these are 46 EU. Uh, I think this is 12 for people. If, if anybody's All from right. US. The EU people are well informed. The Americans, we're going to struggle with that. It's okay. All right. And the last very important personal question uh, for you to answer today. Uh, when optimizing mesh shaders for an NVIDIA GPU, is number of vertices or triangles more important for your calculation? Um, um, uh, um, personally speaking, I would recommend um, optimizing number of vertices, but okay. you know, since it's a personal question, it depends on who you ask. Really. So how you're feeling? Yes. <laughs> the bed, you I wonder if these captions are automatic <laughs> captions or actual, or someone's <laughs> manually typing them. Let's talk a little bit about your time at Roblox. You have now been here for what is over ten years, which is insane. That's a lot of time. Wow, 10 years, that's a long time. Any job, everything 10 years is extensive. So I'd love to hear a little bit from your own thoughts, some of your favorite things you've worked on. You've been around here from a long time, from the beginning. What were some of the most creative, fun projects that really spoke to you over your time? Um, if you come to mind, um, I, will, I will name three, I guess. Okay. So I think the first most favorite project <laughs> uh, is, um, all of them are my favorite. But yes, they're all your children. Um, so one of the very exciting things that I worked on was Smooth Terrain. Yes. Um, for many reasons, but one of them is it's like it defined a new type of material uh, or digital matter, as we call it now, that we just didn't have before. Then, of course, Future is Bright. Yes, um, absolutely. A favorite of amongst everyone. Yeah. As, a, as an um, upstanding YouTuber, it warms my heart that that video is the most viewed one on uh, my YouTube channel. So, you know. um, and then, of course, I'm spending a lot of time these days on Luau, um, which is also w w definitely one of the highlights. Great. That's awesome to hear. So thinking about 10 years in the future, what are some of the biggest challenges and things you'd like to solve or work on? And what can we expect 10 years down the road at our next late night talk show slash award show where we'll go through this question? Yeah. So um, maybe one of the biggest challenges definitely is anytime we reach some sort of milestone that is numeric, like number of parts, number of players, number of world, etc. You talk to Dave, and Dave is like, "I like the number that is ten times bigger than this one." <laughs> okay. Hmm. And so there are several numbers that are ten times bigger than the current numbers that are daunting but interesting. And so I think yeah, if I look forward. 
that's probably one of the big things. You've heard it here, folks. XB King. The numbers. We Announce the next category. Uh, so that's very Be patient. I think we're gonna have a Be patient, story. XB we're King. Like I'm being patient with the Lego mod. Yeah. So. <laughs> Hi, mom. Very good. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. Very exciting to um, talk to a lot of people um, today and yesterday. Um, a lot of familiar faces and a lot of new faces. Just can't wait to see. I mean, honestly, um, when I look back at when I joined Roblox, the entire company was smaller than the studios, than the top studios that build content on Roblox today. Right. And it's a little mind blowing, like thinking about the number of people who we get to. Affect, give me a PGH, uh, give me a films. You forgot. You forgot L. You forgot L. P. D. Joe Films is epic. Thank you for those oh, that's funny. Arsony, and thanks for joining us today. One more big round of applause for Arsony. Why am I clapping in front of a screen? It's just. <laughs> All right. So next category. As is a celebration of Arsony, uh, you can stay here for now. Uh, oh, okay. We're be presenting the nominees for best ah. use All right. of tech. So without further ado, let's hear who they are. Best use of tech nominees. Best use of tech. All right, this is gonna get interesting. Who is going to be the best use of? Oh, that's Tunneler. Oh, I like Portal's physics. I like VR hands. I like VR hands a lot. Front lines is also really good too. I mean, look at that. It's just beautiful. Rolling thunder. Oh, I've seen that too! That's also so good! Oh, I don't know which one to choose at this point. Alright folks, in our city, since you are my special guest today, I would love if you could do me the honors of revealing to the world who... A lot of responsibility. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what you're known for, is having a lot of responsibility. Uh, so, let's let them know who the winner is. And the winner for best use of tech is... Tunneler! 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 <laughs> oh, that's good! Hello, I'm Homemade Meal, the developer of Tunnler. Thank you so much for voting on Tunnler for an award. It's always been my dream to create an award-worthy game ever since I saw my first Roblox award show. I'm happy to find out it was all worth it in the end. I promise to keep making quality games like this. Thank you again. Bye. Okay. He seems Thank nice. Thank you so much for joining me, Arsony. It's been a pleasure. Thanks again, and uh, we'll talk soon. All right, Arsony, the man, him, the legend, the myth. He is real. Okay. Coming up next, uh, we're gonna have a, a new a new fun category here. We're gonna talk through some of our video stars. So, coming video up next, star of the year for video star video of the year. And oh, we have none other than a video from our very own. Sabrina oh shoot! Tell us who it is. So, oh shoot! Ado, okay. Let's turn to Sabrina okay. Bright to mm. do the video star video. Of oh, the year. okay. Like any creative endeavor, All right. making videos that are original and entertaining is not easy to do. It oh, my heart's pounding. Who is it going to be? I want Oblivious to win, if it's not me. From hilarious antics to jaw-dropping animated films, this next category All right. is a showcase of the videos our oh, creators shoot. can't get enough of. Here are the nominees. Oh, sorry to get lightheaded right now. Video of the year. All right, here we go. Oblivious HD. Stronger. The Bacon Hair. It's fun, a eh? My one million dollar Oh, come on. Roblox. Oh, my gosh. Invictor. Oh, I'm getting lightheaded already. What? All right, all right. How are we all doing what? out what? there? It's been a wonderful night, and I am here in the audience with some of the folks attending they, they did not. this year's Roblox Innovation Awards. How are we all feeling? Good. Very good. good. Great, yeah. great. Everyone's they not good. It's good. I'm scared when someone says not great. Uh, we'll find out why. Uh, but today, uh, I'm going to get your help a bit, I think. Okay. Talking about our next award. So you just heard the nominees. I think they are ready to find out who the next video star video winner yes. is for this year. You mean to hold the mic? Wait. Help we didn't why did I not show? Out. Okay. For you. Salad, whatever you need. And the winner All right. is... Oh, my God. Video star of the year is... Okay. It's funny. Oh! It's funny? That oh, that's something. Wild. Fantastic. Hey, Should we see your video? We are crazy. We are so honored and grateful to be chosen for a video of the <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> you got skipped. Oh no, people are freaking out. People are absolutely freaking out. <laughs> I'm not even upset or mad. This is just funny. <laughs> 
for video of the year. All right, all right. I'm not even mad. <laughs> That's actually funny. Oh, people are, uh, they did skip me. How did they skip me? What? Oh, this. Of the year. Not to be confused with the video star video of the year. This is the star themselves. So please, everyone, join me in welcoming to the digital stage a star herself, the Queen of Pink, and my former co-host of a previous award show, Leah Ash. <laughs> I'm off. Oh, I knocked your phone. Every day, millions of people on Roblox are doing more than just laughing with their friends. They're also watching, listening, and laughing along with their favorite video stars. Our nominees tonight represent the vibrant and talented video creators who brought us the most laughs, the most heart, and the most incredible Roblox moments of 2022. All right, who, okay, in that case, who's gonna be the uh, video star of the year? Flamingo. You know, I knew it was happening, video star video. They would rather pick um, the gameplay ones for some reason. I'm not sure why though. But yeah, let's see who who is gonna win this one. Box. I just wonder how did they? Oh well. Clean up. All right, everybody. You know, there's an old proverb that goes, "If you need a good drum roll, do it yourself." So without further ado, let's hear my drum roll. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna practice that. But without further ado, the winner of Video Star of the Year is right, who's is it gonna be? Flamingo. Yes. Oh yeah. Flamingo won. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I should be hearing. I don't mean to disturb you, but I'm supposed to deliver you this letter. For me. <laughs> what I do. I won. And I. And I wrote a speech. Thank you so much, and I mean it, for this Creator of the Year Award. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's funny. I'm surprised me or Oblivious didn't even win that Thank one. You so much to all the I am so creators, confused. All the stars out there of the internet that make it so vibrant and full of life, and a special thanks to Flamingo and all of you who are nominated. Congratulations for being stars. All right, coming up next, we're gonna break into another one of our short interviews to learn more about some awesome creators on the platform. This extraordinary duo established their own studio, built a video empire, and captured the hearts of many all around the world. So without further ado, please give me a roar of the Roblox welcome to the founders of Wonderworks Studio, Megan and Zach Letter. I wonder, hey, while I'm doing this, let me go check Twitter, see if there's anything. at home, we've got waters, we've got ferns. Oh, amazing. Yeah, they're smaller this year, we're having a drought. That's um, a snake plant, that's not a fern. Okay, well, I didn't know you were a botanist. Cool fun fact, <laughs> off the uh, yeah. off the cusp, uh, so it's very exciting. Uh, welcome, how are we doing today? Good, yeah, I'm amazing, feeling great. Amazing, yeah. Great. So a little background. Oh no, I feel like people are gonna get there. mad at me. Oh, people people are gonna get uh, mad at Roblox Mary. for... You are running a studio, uh, a business, you still make constant video content together, and rumor is you still get along, is that true? Yeah, we, uh, yeah. <laughs> we were born in the darkness of working together. Okay, we've, yes. We've been able to kind of rise through it mm -hmm. from the very beginning. Awesome, so, so let's, uh, let's let the folks know kind of what is your origin story? Where did you two meet? How did you yeah. become the duo? Yeah, we met in 2015 in Galveston, Texas at a gaming convention. I had 100 subscribers, he had over a million. I was way too small for the convention, he was way too big for it. And we just ended up on a panel together and started working together after that. I did some voice okay, acting that's for nice. him and Yeah, we recorded history. videos together and then yeah. eventually became more than friends and started dating, got married. Oh dear, people are getting mad over, <laughs> it's funny. Yes, fantastic. I know, I know guys, so I know. Doing, how do you guys How's... balance this kind of work life? Uh, of it all. So I am so yourself, confused. Or do you? Oh well. Um, that's a tricky question because we just work day and night. <laughs> um, <laughs> we work all day, and then when Zach gets home from work because he works in office, I work okay. from home. That's where my setup is. We just talk about more work. 
talk oh. about work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're passionate about what we do, so like it's kind of just almost our complete life. Yeah, you know, yeah. Like making videos, playing games, yeah. making games. What's the thing? Kind of ties uh, together. You love what you do. You'll never work uh, a day in your life. It's what brought us together. Yeah. There you go. All right. Well, that is awesome. Um, so I want to look, talk a little bit about uh, some of your individual works here. I know, Megan, you are a major video star. How do you kind of balance that whole persona you have online uh, with who you are outside of that? And, and how do you kind of shift between it all? I am actually pretty much the exact same person as I am online as I am in real life. I would say maybe I'm more animated and higher pitched in my videos. But if anyone goes to my vlog channel, they can see the real me, which is the same person. Oh, hey, Sharky, thank you for the five dollars. I appreciate it. Hello from Jam, Zio, Rachel, Amy, and I. Oh, dear, you guys are really mad. You guys are really mad. It's not. I'm so confused, though. It's funny. I mean, I respect the award, actually. Yeah, huh. it's been interesting. Obviously, yeah, that was something. I guess you can just move on. on making videos versus going into the office and having a bunch of people rely on me. It's it's a lot different, but I think we have a lot of creative and talented people surrounding us, so they make it easy. Mm -hmm. Fantastic, fantastic. All right, folks, so this is going to be a short interview, but I want to give you a chance if there's any final things you'd like to say to the world, anything to promote you're working on, what can we expect coming out here? Last chance for some good words to the lovely uh, folks out there. Well, we think that this is really cool. Thank you so much to Roblox for inviting us out. Yeah, it's really amazing. There's so many people here. It's so glamorous, beautiful, three-course dinner. Yeah. This was new. This was exciting. Yeah, and yeah, and we're we're really excited to like meet every all the devs that we've been talking to on like different social medias and just finally getting to put like a face yeah. to the avatar for the first time. It's been amazing, um, and we're mostly excited for one of our big releases this year, uh, Pooh, a dark, grungy, <laughs> disgusting horror game. Uh, Excellent. With your favorite character, Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. We all look forward to Pooh. Yeah. You've heard it here, folks. <laughs> Oh yeah, uh, so what is going to be the most immersive environment? Hang out for a little bit here as we are going to introduce our next category. And speaking of immersive world, this next award is for the most immersive environment. Without further ado, let's see who the nominees are for most immersive environment. Okay, now what is the most immersive environment? Interval. Oh, that's pretty good. Springs Rock. Druid's Sanctuary. If you actually guys go attack, it's funny. I'm actually going to be really disappointed in you. Don't do that. That's not the right thing to do. Oh, okay. 3008. I like that game. I want to see that win. See if that happens. Hmm. Big responsibility. And the winner of the most immersive environment is... This isn't the right card. This says video star of the year is <laughs> Flamingo. Congratulations. <laughs> That's funny. That's the wrong yeah, card. At such an award show. Uh, what happens? We're going to play a little card shuffle. Uh, Flamingo, congratulations again. Uh, very wonderful. Okay. Has to be SCP. Has to be SCP. PHL, I feel that I hear the anger in your voice. No? Not really? I, I, I seriously, okay, so I, actually, seriously, I'm not. I'm not upset. Oh, Interval. Okay, that's nice. A plot to that. Man, 3008 didn't work. Oh well, that's, that's still fine. ...from scratch in 24 hours, including music, lighting, programming, and building. 24 hours? ...to this new world we built. Utilizing the latest and greatest Roblox had to offer. Finished with our innovative music and visual effects... It's pretty short. ...to bring it to life. We're so grateful for such high recognition, and can't wait to create more for you guys. Thank you. And we are back, folks. I want to thank my guests, Megan and Zach, again for being on the show. And I will help uh, escort you out. Thanks again thank for being here. Thank You're you. wonderful participants. It's been great. Thanks for giving Flamingo an extra shout out. Uh, it's great. Um, oh, well, that was interesting. Just keeps chugging along. I hope you guys are ready for the fast paced action that is the. Oh, dear, people are still mad. I am your pilot, as you Come on, guys. Later. It's not so, really a big of a deal. Next is a very exciting segment. We've got a special guest star to present a video for you, and she is my future best Oh, here people are. Tell you about the use of avatar fashion. 
So without further ado, let's hear what Carly Kloss has to say about best use of Avatar fashion. Hi everyone, I'm Carly Kloss, and tonight I am honored to be presenting the award for best use of Avatar fashion. Oh, best the use of Avatar fashion. I okay, I want to see Roblox community who wins Avatar this one actually. And it was truly one of the most inspiring oh dear, well Twitter is mad. You know, I should expect this. <laughs> and passion that goes into every oh, Twitter is mad. Please don't actually attack her. Please don't actually. Remarkable. And I'm so excited oh, that's Twitter. You can't stop it. The future of digital fashion. One of the things I love most about Roblox is that it enables so many different forms of self-expression. With the introduction especially of layered clothing on Roblox, there's even more possibilities for digital fashion than ever before. And so, without further ado, here are the nominees for the best use of Avatar fashion. Best use of Avatar fashion. Mermaid life. Okay, so that's mermaid life. World Zero. World Zero. Okay, that's pretty good. Oh yeah, I know this game. Royal High. I know that game too. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm gonna drink good some water. Job. Online. It's not Gacha, it's Gacha Online! It says, he, he said Gacha. Kachow. Oh, donations. Um, Umber Qualker, Wolfie Gacha, and Jazz, thank you so much for the donations, I appreciate it a lot. winner of best use of Avatar fashion is... Mermaid Life! So Mermaid Life actually won. My name nice. Is I am the game designer behind Mermaid Life. Hey, I think I just saw you. But hey, glad they won. All of the beautiful fashion items that we provide to the players of our game, and I wanted to thank you guys for nominating Mermaid Life for Avatar Best Use of Fashion this year. We are so grateful to be working on such a wonderful platform, and to be nominated for the Roblox Innovation Awards. Thank you so much. Woohoo! All right. Thank you, Anne and Misa. Congratulations to the entire team of Mermaid Life. You're just so Oh, stylish. dear, people are still okay. mad. People are still Please yeah, stop, guys. Awards for you all tonight. Hope you're enjoying the meal. Hope you're enjoying the company, and I hope you're enjoying the fine, fine wines and drinks. So, uh, we've got another very special guest star we're going to cut to on our sat stage over here. And please. All right, let's see who the next guest is. Very fun person. The winner of the 2021 Builderman Award of Excellence, a man who always looks good in pink. Please, everyone, join me in giving him a big ahoy welcome to Minitune. Oh! Okay! Hey, I didn't know you were going to be here. Minitune. Yeah, Minitune! I'm glad to see you're here. I'm doing fantabulous, Mr. J. <laughs> <laughs> you look great. You look I love fantastic. emo boys. Thank you. You look great yourself. Nice. The suspenders from back here. Thank you. You you free later tonight by any chance? <laughs> Glad me tunes here. Mini tune, I'll always make time for you. Always time for. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Without further ado, you take it away. Gotcha. Well, sitting among us tonight are creators from around the world, from Asia to Europe and the Americas and beyond. But no matter where we come from, we all share some common goal to bring our ideas to life yep. in the most creative <laughs> and innovative ways possible. The award for best international hit recognizes an outstanding experience created by a developer outside of the United States. Here are the nominees. Best international hit. Welcome to Bloxburg. Oh yeah, I know that game. Tower of Hell. Oh, they actually said it. Nice. Well, it's not really a bad word in general. Live Topia. I don't think I've seen that game before. Okay. Club Roblox. Club Roblox. Okay. And the award goes to Even if I what guys, even if I wasn't cut out, I wasn't going to win anyway. Just like No Way Home. Welcome to Bloxburg. Ah, yeah! <laughs> Applause for that. That's great. Like No Way Home said, expect disappointed and you expect disappointment and you won't be disappointed. 
Well, not all the time in some cases. Is it hot in here or is it just you guys? Even after spending over a decade on Roblox, I can't tell you how amazed I am at the potential there is to innovate. You can invent entirely new genres, dream up vast and expansive worlds, or go wild and make an experience about a diabolical pig intent on chasing you and your friends, because why not? The possibilities are endless. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> That's why this next award is so special, because it recognizes the studio... Ah, oh, I'm so glad you're here. Of harnessing those possibilities and turning them into something amazing. Funny guy. So with that, I'm pleased to present the nominees for Developer Studio of the Year. Developer Studio of the Year. All right, let's see this one. Easy, GG. All right, they made the stuff, the Bedwar stuff. Okay. Game fam. Oh, they made. Please donate. I did not know that. Splitting Point Studios. Okay, I know them for their field trip C. Century game. I'm sorry, I do not know that sadly. I'm saying Splitting Point Studios. And the award goes to I don't know about you guys, but the suspense is killing me. Developer Studio of the Year award goes to Easy GG. Ah! Acceptable! Their games are pretty good anyway, so that's good. Alrighty, folks! Thank you so much again, Minitune. This year you're gonna win my favorite tune award. So, big round of applause again. Thank you to our winners and for Minitune for helping us out. You did good, me too. You did good. <laughs> My voice is getting hoarse right now. I should probably stop talking for a little bit. However, the best is yet to come. So once again, we're going to take a slow down, a little pause. We're going to do one more set of interviews with a fantastic duo of developers from across the world. Yes, that's right. They're from the land down under, down under. You may know it as New Zealand. So everyone, please put your hands together and welcome to the stage our favorite Kiwis, Jandel and Forex. <laughs> Excellent. Welcome to the show. So glad to have you guys looking dapper. Oh my goodness, ever. people are so, so mad. Oh, come on. It's funny. It deserves a win, okay? You guys, I gotta at least appreciate something. People are, that might be your favorite, they have favorite table. They got some yeah. big fans. Uh, well, happy to have you. Uh, it's been an incredible run today. Yeah. A fantastic show. Uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. So I believe now, as I'm keeping track, you might have been the most nominated uh, studio in games for awards that has not won one yet. <laughs> that do is you, true, do, yeah. Do you, do you understand how Leonardo DiCaprio feels now? Yeah, yep. We, uh, we nominated for two so far. Okay, great. One zero, so. Yeah, well, uh, <laughs> you're just so far. Yeah, so far. <laughs> your cheer and excitement is is unrelenting, and I think you're gonna, you're going to take it one of these days. Don't you worry, Leo. Um, Thanks. Anyway, it's been fantastic to have you on the show, and we'd love to get to know a little more about you for all the adoring fans out there. So I think uh, just a little history for you folks, uh, Chandel and Forex. I've been on Roblox a long time. They're working on some PDHL films. films. How do you feel Future right now? I'm so actually pumped right now. I'm okay, Kai. Thank you for asking. How about you? Constantly working around the clock, making like seriously, I'm 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 not mad at all, actually. I'm I'm enjoying this. Don't worry. It's so funny though. It's so funny though. I was expecting Oblivious to win. Anyway, moving on. So Matt is pretty much the only other developer in New Zealand. There's two others, so there's four of us, and um. I was like, you know what? We're both Roblox developers. So I sent him a message. I was like, hey, let's hang out. And Matt's like, yeah, I've got football training that night, so let's do it next week. And next week was like 12 months later. So <laughs> he kind of ghosted me. <laughs> Some would say a wise decision. <laughs> <laughs> and do you regret that uh, acceptance of friendship since? Yeah, yeah. I, I, yes, I, great. I would say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he, we're best friends now, so it was his Be loss. Yeah. Best friends, you've heard it here. <laughs> All right, and how long ago was this? When did you guys start? Well, the start of pandemic is when we actually first started talking. Yeah. New Zealand was locked down. We spent a lot of time in, in lockdown together. Okay. A lot of like... Oh, really? Uh, yeah. 
quality time. <laughs> it, was, it was too much time. But, uh, quality time. Still getting along. I gotta ask you the same questions yeah. as Megan and Zach, and you're still getting along after yeah. all these projects together. Uh, yeah, well, maybe once we get off the stage, we'll need to see each other again. <laughs> okay. What was the very first project you guys worked on together? Wacky Wizards. Wacky, Wacky Wizards. Wizards. Yep. Yeah. Yes, Wacky Wizards, <laughs> an absolute crowd hit. I personally have enjoyed it. Uh, is Cra Wacky Wizards your favorite game you guys have worked on? Your favorite yeah. experience? Yeah. I, I think it has to be, yeah. It's so much fun to work on, so. And you got some new projects coming up. Uh, in Justin the plays. Peter Joe Films, are you sad or okay? I am you, uh, yeah. not do sad. Don't, no, seriously, I'm actually not sad. Don't worry. Okay. Game, fun game. It's just any best game set in Vietnam. It's awesome. <laughs> but seriously, guys, you got to calm down, okay? Okay. Um, PD Joe Films is epic. Can you take Factual Dev? No. No. You you could not. This is what I'm talking about, guys. My fan base is nuts! Okay, well. Anyway, moving on. I forgot. Who's Wacky Wizards again? Oh, how did I forget that? Forget that. Yeah. Don't worry about it, just make the next game. Just do what you love. Yeah. Yep. Awesome. You heard it here, folks. Do what you love. Life is always good. Uh, thank you guys so much for having you out here today. Uh, I did have one last bonus challenge question uh, for the two of you. You know, we've heard the word innovation a lot today. Yeah. And I, so I think it's a very important question that I have for you. Uh, and about innovation, Jensen, how do you spell innovation? <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it. <laughs> no, do it. I, I don't know. You don't, don't, they don't give you. It's written on the card. Oh I'm yeah. Holding. E I N N O V A. No, that's a tilt. You got it wrong. Anyway, okay. he did his best, everyone. Uh, innovation has a tilt <laughs> built in. Remember that. I spell it R B L X. Um, well, it's been fantastic to have you guys on the show. We need to move things along a little bit. So we're going to talk about the next award here. And this is a very exciting one. I'm having you present uh, for me because this is going to be the People's Choice Award. So without further ado, let's see the nominees for this year's People's Choice Award. People's Choice. Captain Angel made a thread about something. Thank you, Captain Angel. You are actually smart for once. Brookhaven. The people that are mad at funny are not. So, therefore, for people who are mad at funny, I am disappointed. All right, Jensen, are you ready to do the great honor of revealing the people's choice for I am. tonight? I'm ready. I'm I present ready. you the great envelope. Hopefully, this is the right one. I <laughs> All hope right. so as well. And the winner is. Bedwars. Who is it? Bedwars. <laughs> Bed Wars. <laughs> wait, is this? Yeah, Bed Wars. Wait, 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 wait. Bed Wars. Bed Wars. <laughs> Bed Wars. <laughs> well, I'm glad that game won, so that's good. Oh, yeah, so, oh, yeah, um. Millie? Yes, it's actually... Yeah, just... Just be upset with Roblox, but do not attack them, because saying something about it won't work, can't do anything about it. So, might as well just accept it. Anyway, just stop talking about the topic. Just move on. Alright, everyone, let me turn to my trusty note cards. All right, friends, we are quickly approaching the end of our show. We hope the food is good and the entertainment even better. But coming up next, I'd like to introduce a very special person to the stage to give out our very last and maybe most important award. You may know this man as the creator of Roblox, as the rock star who entered the show with a sweet, sweet red suit. He's Builder Man. He may yep, be your dad. Saw it. To us, he's our CEO and founder, the one and only. Builder oh yeah, donations. CJG, thank you for the five dollars. Have you been a voice actor? Yeah, I'm a voice actor for my films. Everyone's the same voice actor in my films. Oh, I bet they get that on any second. I can give you this, but it might let's not reach. Yeah, let's, let's see. Let me see this guy. Hello, world. Oh, I can't test. I have a mic. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> uh, 
this is great. We'll keep hanging out. We'll keep hanging out. Use your mic. Yeah, we'll pull this forward as we get to the end here. Uh, we can check on this. Let's see if it's on one more time. I'm going to give it a couple seconds. I'm assuming right now a sound person is sprinting us another handheld out from the back. The oh, look at the booth is going crazy. Okay, we're good. <laughs> we're oh, good. <laughs> I was wondering what was happening. That's Builder Man. Yippee. Okay, so, um, we go a little off script. We may have redundancy. Okay, that's all right. I'm pretty sure you may be doing a lot of thanks as well at the end. They want to hear it. They want to hear it all every we're time. We're going to have like redundant thanks for uh, the vision of the creation of this show first. So the Roblox teams that did this, this is just over the top. Like, thank you. So let's give it up. I think you're going to say the same thing, right? Yeah. No, no, no. I'm going to mix it up. We'll pl I'm okay. gonna riff off, it's gonna be glorious. And the, uh, just the Roblox community, man, you dress up well. Like, <laughs> oh my gosh, it's amazing. Okay, so uh, this year's award, um, are we just, we're just gonna show the video of the winner, right? I think I, I do have a, an envelope just for you, uh, as I know would be an honored tradition okay. to have you. So I wanna give some background on the Builder Man Award of Excellence. Um, I can hold it for you. Okay, you can hold yeah. it. So for those of you that were on Roblox 15 years ago plus, you might have remembered the, the vision we had in trying to get creation everywhere. So um, we've been working on this for 15 plus years. The, the finalists for this award, I think it took me about a week. To, yes, we had a long back and uh, forth. You're like back and forth, come on Dave, because like, it was <laughs> so very, very difficult. And we leaned in to an experience that was both super high quality, super polished, and pushing a little bit of that vision of creation everywhere. So I love seeing this. There's a huge future. Oh my goodness, people are so mad. <laughs> on the platform. And uh, I think I've said this about 80 times in the show, but it's really like you love all of your children. I love all of the experiences. So um, super hard. So, okay. so. Should I? I'll go through the motions, right? Yeah, yeah. You go through the motions. I can even open it for you. Want okay. me to get the break? So the these deal? results were tabulated by Price Waterhouse. Yes, um, that's right. Uh, officially compiled. Thank you. And so the Builder Man Award of Excellence goes to Starving Artists by Double Bandit Studios. Starving Artists. Woohoo! Really nice. I really liked it. And I believe we have the Starving Artists video. To oh, yeah. Builder Man Award of Excellence. I want to see this one. Hey, artists. I'm Entrance. And I'm LA Girls. And we're all hey, Starving, 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 Starving Artists. Artists. Receive the Builder Man Award of Excellence. Thank you, Builder Man, for making this all possible. We want to give a big thank you to our partners, contributors, and our amazing community. We couldn't have done it without you. Growing up in Jamaica, there weren't many opportunities, but Roblox allowed me to turn my dreams into reality, and I hope I can inspire others to do the same. Thank, thank you, you everyone. everyone. Okay, thank you. Okay. All righty. Jay Party, we're gonna go back to you as you land the plane All right. on this amazing journey. Thank you, co-pilot. stay up here with you. Couldn't do it without you. All right, folks, it is unfortunately that sad time of the evening where we say goodbye to this year's awards and enjoy our food and enjoy the fine evening that lies ahead of us. But first, I do wanna say some thank yous to everyone who's been involved in making this dream become a reality. So first and foremost, I do want to call some key players out here. Nicole, we PD Joe Films, are you Nicole? planning to add any other voice actors for your film's movies? Um, probably not. The only voice actor I have that's separate is Spidella's voice actor, but I'm not going to talk about that until the film comes out. Rebecca, Kim, Jason, of course, Matt, and Neha. I want to thank the Tech team, the sound, the lighting, everyone behind it. Jamie and Kelly, you are awesome. Monica and Mark for running around and ensuring that things happened on time. You all have been incredible. Without further ado, I hope you enjoyed today's show. I'm sure you will let us know because developers, you guys love to tell me what's up and that's what I love you for. Uh, it's been fantastic. You're the most creative geniuses in the world. Thank you for making this the greatest, most wholesome community. Wait, wait, wait. Where's the best content update? Did I miss that? Wait, did I miss that? Oh my god. What? This world is yours for the making. Without further ado, folks, this has been the Innovation Awards of RDC 2022. Put it together for all of you, the real winners, the real heroes. Thanks to the winners, to the nominees, to every creator out there. Let's enjoy the food and drink. I'm Jay Party. This is good night. Hey,
Is that is that it? Are they like gonna um Hold on, is it actually over or wait, they skipped a lot of stuff. Where's the where's the rest of the awards? Where's best content update? Huh. That is strange. Okay, so I'm pretty sure they um Yeah, that- I am so wait, that actually ended? That's it? What? Oh, what? I- I'm surprised that's it. Where is the content of- I'm- did they just forget that? They actually did forget that. Huh. Well. That was actually quite a- Yeah, they- they skipped a ton. They actually skipped a ton. I am so confused. They missed a lot of things. Huh. I, I'm I'm still so confused. I'm still so confused. Hey, um... I, th I feel like I have some plenty of time left. You guys want to keep reacting to this? If you guys want to do that before we end the stream, because... It... Oh, wait. Hold on. Um... Guys, can you check? Is there going to be an after party soon? I'm pretty sure there's no way they can skip that. Is there an after party soon? Can you guys check that for real quick? For real quick? Honestly, not sure. But maybe we should like. <laughs> maybe we should... I feel like this event was probably rushed. But either way, it was quite fun to watch, though. Wait a second. Hold on a second, I should probably, um, hold on, can I show you guys this real quick about the skip thing? I was a not, yeah, so, let's, let's summarize everything that happened today. So, Roblox skipped a few things. There's no best content update. I got skipped for some reason, <laughs> which was so funny to look at. Now, hold on, um, we're gonna go to Twitter real quick. Hold on, let me go get this. Let's, let's take, take a look how many people are really mad at what's happening right now. Like, um... So, this, also this, yep, uh, that, that too. Ella. Um, yep, that too. Lots of, oh wow, that's one way to say it, actually. Ah, well, you know, even, yes, again, even though if I didn't win, I'm still, I, at least I was a nominee. Okay, so, let's see here. Um, right here, this... Hold on a second. Well, let me go check this one real quick. Just in case. Hold on, let me go here and show you guys what the previous awards were. Hold on, media. Uh, let me scroll all the way down. Oh, wow, this is a lot. Okay, anyway. This is what, this is what showed up. I was there, but I got skipped. I have absolutely no idea what happened. Not sure what happened, but it's really, really strange. Man, like, what a bizarre live stream. But hey, I quite enjoyed it nonetheless, you know? Okay. And then there's like, please, I, please, I, I understand, guys. I, I understand, but yeah, I think I should just stop this here. All right, hold on. But anyway, thank you for your support, guys. I appreciate it all. You have no idea how much this means to me. Even if we didn't win, I'm surprised that we went this far. And yeah, you have no idea how much this means to me. I, I appreciate it a lot. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank